listen, I think the moving forward, the Democratic Party and the Republican Party are different parties, and the, it's everybody but the people who are against corporate interests. Let's just make this very clear. Everybody shifts to the right because they don't want to go with anything that challenges the corporate infrastructure right now, at least since 1978. But moving forward, the infrastructure that we have to focus on, and I hope that a lesson from from tonight and moving forward on is it's not just about being left leaning and like you were saying earlier you know we partner up with these organizations that are like left light or or say they're progressive but then don't stand with us in solidarity and moving forward we have to actually understand this process i mean i screamed this from the mountaintops but they crushed us the democratic party is not an actual party it's an illusion there aren't active members. They've never really voted on things until a couple of years ago. They're, they're, everybody who makes a decision has been appointed by Tom Perez, and Tom Perez was appointed essentially by Barack Obama. So it is on us right now mm -hmm. to pay attention when it's not hot on MSNBC, right. and it's not a fight, right. but, but pay attention at the local level and not just run for races. That's important. But when you don't have staff to support... The candidate's running, because that's really happening right now. You should also go out there and, and learn about what what to do, how to run a field operation. Right. Not just say it and then, like, you know, start a consulting firm. We're talking about really getting into the nitty-gritty. That's what they do. And if the numbers are on our side, and they have been since the late 70s, frankly— you know, the Republicans out, out, out maneuvered us. They redistricted the entire country and the Democrats zapped all the money from the state parties and we've been annihilated. It is on us right now to make sure that the 70 percent of Democrats that are under 50 who supported Bernie are in power in the next four years.